I'm going to discuss what how to install DB browser for SQLite. So first here we need to download this DB browser. So you can see right in Google search box DB browser. Then you can get the site this one. Then after click on this DB browser for SQLite. Click on this download button. Then you can get here DB browser that's for. Or 32 bit windows and 64 bit windows so this is zip file and msi file you can get there so i'm clicking on this to download the msi file the size is now 17 mb only so if i scroll down then you can see or uh, this here to get the db browser for mac os by clicking that and if I scroll down, then you can do the DB browser on Linux also. You can get here. And to, to install DB browser on Linux, you can use this command. Okay. So now here, the 50% that's over. And after that, I will discuss how we can install this one. And here you can see on the Adam database there are three uh, database for SQLites that's created. You can see the tab is SQLite. Now I'm going to see the status. So it's almost done. Now thereafter click on this MS5 file, then click on OK. And the installation wizard that's come there, click on next. Here I accept next. Then uh, clicking their desktop only, click on next, next, install. Then yes, and now this installation that has been done. And now you can see there is the icon that's created, DB Browser SQLite. Double click out there. So first here, we need to get here or uh, open the database. Click on this open database then you need to select the database so i already have the database on the desktop adams clicking on the test clicking on open now you can see there is the three or uh, tables are present there emp employees first and if i click on this browse data so you can see there is the mp records if i select employees records and here first it has nothing okay now we, we can do some edit this place execute the query write the query this places and you can execute the query now thereafter we can do multiple operation or multiple things we can do inside the db browser for sqlite we can import the files we can export the files attach database close database and many more we can do this places so this is how we can install DB browser for SQLite. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.